What does the work of Navanet look like? And specifically, what do we mean by being behavioral designers? How is it different from consulting? Keep watching to learn more. The two main differentiating factors that characterize our work are the frameworks and the methodology we use. This is best summed up by the 3B framework. 3Bs stand for behavior, barriers, and benefits. To apply this framework, we will first ask, what is the key behavior that we aim at changing? We proceed first by doing a behavioral map. We try to isolate all the steps surrounding the outcome and find a key behavior. The more specific we get, the more accurate our solution will be. The next step is finding barriers, frictions that prevent that behavior from happening. We start by sorting through all the steps leading up to the key behavior. Out of all the steps, can we reduce them? And if not, can we simplify them? Next question to ask at this stage is, are there cognitive biases at play? That is, unconscious models that make the user deviate from our desired behavior. Can we intervene in these biases, erase them, or reduce their influence? The last stage involved is benefits. Do people get any rewards from completing a process you just analyzed? Are these rewards of emotional nature or rather functional? Is this present or future? Another question is, are the rewards appearing distant in time, from the moment of the decision? We are present by us, and we can't do anything about it. There are many ways to interpret the reward factor, and creativity is key in the field of behavioral science. Once we found a possible solution, it's time to experiment. Can we set up a controlled trial? Can we randomize results? It's important to validate a theory that we can test and make it statistically sound. The process goes deeper than this, but this can give you an idea of the frameworks and methodology we use at Nova Dutch. Let's design better decision environments for our clients and make an impact. Let's nudge for good together.